Hey guys, welcome back to another really quick tutorial. I just want to teach you how to create text to mesh in Blender. It's super easy. Let's go ahead and hop into it. We're in a new Blender file here. Let me go ahead and delete this cube, delete the light, and then we're going to go to add text. And then as you can see, our text is laying flat right here. If you press tab, you can actually go ahead and type in here. So I'm going to type in um, Blender 3D. Okay, tab out of edit mode there. And I'm gonna go to my top down view so I can see everything. You can scale this up and down, you can rotate it. I'm gonna rotate it on the X axis, 90 degrees. And then over here on the right hand side, you're gonna see this little button that looks like an A. We're gonna click on that. We're gonna pop open geometry. And right here, you can now extrude your text as much as you want. You can go crazy with it if you want. I'm gonna do it just a little bit like that. That looks perfect. And then when you're happy with this, you wanna right click and go to convert to mesh. And that's literally it. Your 3D, um, your 3D text is now a mesh. You're good to go. At this point, you guys can pretty much do whatever you want. As you can see, the geometry is a little bit funky, but if you really wanted to, you could go ahead, save this real quick, go over to the modifiers tab, and then you want to click on your modifiers, and you could add in a remesh modifier. Now, at first, it's going to look a little weird, but depending on what you want this to look like, you can go ahead and define these custom voxel dimensions here. So you can, do it, you can do it with voxel, you can do it with smooth. There's many different options for what you can do here. Blocks is another one. You can go to sharp. And you also want to make sure, sorry guys, you want to make sure you have remove disconnected unselected there, or it's going to look really weird. Um, this one might be a good option here. I'll just go to 11 there. I'll go ahead and apply that. Now I just want to show you guys the difference here. When you tab into edit mode, you're going to see that you have a very high quality mesh now. Now, you don't have to do it that way, but I just want to show you guys kind of how to create that 3D text. And then, of course, you can apply your own modifiers to this. You can apply your own materials. You can shade this auto smooth, make it look really smooth. Um, you can pretty much do whatever you want. Um, and then in the next tutorial, I'll show you guys how to actually convert an SVG into a mesh as well. So this was just a quick way to do that in Blender. I hope you guys learned something. Um, like I said, you do have full opportunity to modify this mesh now and do whatever you need to do with it. So guys, I hope you learned something. I will talk to you guys in the next tutorial.